the sims 4 horse friend pack comes out in less than a month and naturally it just feels right it just makes sense like the lord came out of the skies even though it doesn't exist and told me that today i needed to sit down and record Sims three pets but focusing mainly on horses and we have our scout here i call him scout actually and he is themed from the sims 4 horse ranch because there's sheep in it do you know what my favorite animal are sheep specifically lambs i asked my father to steal me a lamb when i was a child and i genuinely thought there was nothing wrong with that i genuinely thought he would go into that field and steal me a lamb never happened so i had to steal this lamb i didn't i paid for real money for him i paid for this lamb your honor for legal reasons and like i did actually genuinely pay for that lamb i don't know why i'm cracking on this if i stole that lamb did not steal this lamb i bought him like i literally can get the receipts i bought him from flamingo land check the cctv i bought this lamb I don't know if there's really any much else to say. Today we're going to be playing with horses in The Sims 3. I haven't actually, well, I, d I do now, but I didn't originally have The Sims 3 pets in. Fucking! I'm honestly having like a nightmare with tech at the minute. I didn't have The Sims 3 installed on this PC yet because when my PC broke, it got wiped to fix it and I had to reinstall everything. I don't even have The Sims 1 installed on this PC yet, but I do have The Sims 3 and all expansion packs installed so that's all i need welcome to the sims 3 expansion and stuff pack manager here you can quickly and easily choose which packs you want to play with the choice is yours so have fun i'm gonna turn everything off apart from the sims 3 pets because i want the full experience of the sims 3 pets i don't want to be distracted by anything else and like i know what i'm like and i will get distracted by other things as well <laughs> i love the sims 3 pets it's just like oh Hannah Montana, I do declare. <laughs> I love it, I love it, I love it, I love it, I love it. I love it. So, so. All right, can we skip? Because I need to sort this all out for Declan because Declan will kill me. He won't. Declan is so lovely and so nice. Yeah, like I wish I could have like a proper groove, you know? Like I wish I knew how to groove. I can only do choreographed dancing. Like that's the only thing I feel comfortable doing. Oh my God. Like line dancing, guys. I might learn how to line dance. But wait, you know what? While we wait, I'm going to show you my, all my knowledge of line dancing because that's coming out with the horse ranch expansion let me just move my seat right this is my knowledge of line dancing boom boom clap boom 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 one foot in, one eighty twist, and a zigzag, step and slide, lean and let the clap three times, shake it out, head to toe, throw it all together. That's how we roll through the hoe down. Oh. Admittedly, admittedly, I lost a little bit of steam after the first two steps, and I just went to down the Hannah Montana route, which is something I do tend to do. You're on I do. Oh, I don't have my Fitbit on. Didn't even check my heart rate. Might try and learn how to line dance before the expansion packs out. I feel like that would be a good use of my time. Uploads are going to be a little bit less frequent, guys, because I really need to learn how to line dance. That's a joke. Do you know who does line dance? My grandma. Interesting character, my grandma. Deep cut plumbella law. My grandma grew up a spiritualist. She is now christian but she also practices buddhism like she's into all i don't know much about it but she meditates and stuff like that she also go on, so goes on spiritual weekends away really interesting character like truly one in a million one in a million i'll never get another character quite like her one of a kind my granddad who passed away last year love him miss him so much like really dearly actually there's a funny story that he tells that because my grandma's a spiritualist and like box of the dead and shit that one time he was just sat in his living room and he saw an awe about the corner of his eye and he went if you're looking for pat she's not here then it went i just thought it was one of my because my granddad did not believe in any of that just the saddest thing for me right it's not actually that sad like obviously i have worse problems in life but when i was at sims camp a couple of years ago the last one before covid actually and i don't even know if sims camp's gonna be a thing anymore I mean, they haven't been. By the by, anyway, we went on a tour of EA's offices, right? And in this one cupboard that opened it up and it was like so much Sims promotional merch, which is my bread and butter. I love a bit of Sims promo merch. Steph found some magazines on eBay that had like early Sims promo stuff in it. I love it. Like I actually fucking love stuff like that. I have the Sims 3 and Sims 4 books. Maybe the Sims 2 books, actually. I can't believe... 10 minutes into recording, I haven't even gotten the fucking game. Oh. Like stuff like this. I'm trying to make a, a video about stuff like this, but I don't really know what to do with it yet. Oh, electrocution, burning and drowning. Good read. So let me know if you have any ideas of like 
videos I could do because I have this one and I have the Sims 4 one. I'm not too sure about the Sims 2. But obviously the Sims 4 one's pretty much defunct now because the game's changed so much. Right, here we are. Appaloosa Plains. Honestly, some of my favourite memories of playing the Sims 3 are in this place. I love Appaloosa Plains. If I had to live in one Sims 3 world for the rest of my life, it would be Appaloosa Plains. The only thing about it that knocks me sick is this dog park shit like a bone. And I don't know why it does. No. No, no. And I think that's going to be an unpopular opinion because I think a lot of people would look at that and think, that's cute, that's cute. But for me, I'm like, it makes me physically sick. Take half the bone away. That's a penis pond. Let's not lie. Well, whatever happened to just having a normal sized pond? One thing I do miss about The Sims 3 is like just being able to load a world and then choose a family from that. Instead of The Sims 4, you always have to create a new family if you want to play in a new world. Well, there's me. But like there's good and bad parts of it. Eugene Hensley. Bah, Harmina Gluchnar. You look really good. Okay, you know what? You'll I'm just going to randomize everything. No, let's have a horse themed. I'm actually going to change your traits to be horse themed. Conflicts with animal lover. I would have thought they were peas in, in a pod. Can you not be an equestrian and a dog person and an animal lover? It's like that Twitter meme where it's like, oh, I like oranges. I like mangoes. What? So you fucking hit oranges? That's what The Sims 3 is doing with this. Easily impressed. I want to be in awe of anything my horse does. I'm going to go lucky. I don't want to be flung off this horse. And a vegetarian. Don't want to eat the horse either. Not that you can. I mean, there's probably a mod for it, to be honest. Uh, friendly let's go friendly the jockey reach level kind of the riding skill i do declare when such earn forty thousand small units using your horses let's go oh my god i don't even have a horse cancel <laughs> right interesting interesting i'm gonna put him in a dungeon under under no the bitches ain't needing the dying hunger motherfucker i need been a long time since i've done that horsey hensley or oh, elder pet god bless him i don't know anything about horses the only thing i know about horses is like the shetland ponies my sister was such a sweet and sensitive child and like she loved Shetland ponies and then she went into the secondary school and it's a self-proclaimed chaff now so now she's like I've never been sensitive in my life actually but yeah she really was sensitive as a kid and she just wrote poetry and really wanted a Shetland pony and she done like horse riding and stuff as well fell in love with an emo girl <laughs> That's beautiful, darling. Honestly, why is this horse's hair more shiny than mine? And don't say because I've bleached the fuck out of it, okay? If in certain lights, there's still some shine. The horses have fringes. Like, is that actually a thing? And does this grow massively or does it grow to a certain length? I thought that was a sandal. Was it? Cinderella lost a shoe. <laughs> God, I, guys, I, I literally... This horse could walk down the street. Nah, I wouldn't know a thing. I'd literally had no idea about these types of horses. Can you draw on them? Because I know on The Sims 4, it's like a full pet... Pet, pet editor but it's like split in different sections oh right so you can't draw in them i do like you having just one oh we can have markings i'm gonna give you a cheetah print is that cheetah print i fucking hope so oh stars oh butterfly fly away took me in turned out the light right i'm gonna give you a cheetah print because i want you to be as fast as you can caper i want you to be agile fast and genius that's my horse we can adjust the picture of the horse i wonder who done the sounds of this in the sims 3 like was this also a horse or was it a human as well all right let's go i might change it from hensley to horsey actually oh i forgot to look at the picture because i think the horse was smiling at the picture he's a good boy all right where are we dropping boys does anywhere already have a stable <laughs> It's a turkey trot. I drained your house. I kind of want something a little bit. Trot a cottage. That's what I call my sister's feet. Trotters. It is a beautiful world. I love any world that's like in autumn. Oh, we have a homey barn for horses. Do we have anything smaller that has a barn? I've never actually played in any of these big houses. A large stable. I will purchase this one. It's a tutorial. I think I am more than you do, sweetheart. Clearly not enough because I clicked continue tutorial. That's em embarrassing for me. Right. Here are the stables. I mean, that is a floating bit of hair right there. Hey, hey. These are the stable. Oh, these are the... Oh, my God. You know what? I love The Sims 3, but like the turning of the camera is just a bit too slow for me. You can put the horse in the stable, but these come as pre-built objects. I try and train him a little bit. You must be riding a horse to do this. Let horsey out. Uh, affection. Talk to. I do want to build a bit of a relationship with him first because horses, you could not fuck with horses. Like I've heard that they were literally... <laughs> Which is whoopy tail, you know? Okay, we are on a horse. Maybe we should train. Let's be let's be let's be serious, Jessica. I did not adopt a horse. Okay, my horse is a little bit scared. He's sad. Okay, he does not like me. Praise for being agile. You're so agile. You're like the most agile of horses. Okay, we well, are getting along a little bit. He, he doesn't like us though. He lets us talk to him. The horse likes me, guys. I would love to get into horse riding. I do think that at one point, like I will get into horse riding. Maybe in the six weeks. 
I might see if my niece wants to go horse riding with me because I just I like I, I love anything that gives me the illusion that I'm flying. I think I've said this before on this channel, but I absolutely love the f the feeling of flying. Like I have dreams where I just fly with my head. My mom thinks I'm astral projecting. I don't really know what that means, so I saw it on what's it called? Not Babadook. Tiptoe through the window. That film. I saw it on that film. So I think that's what my mom thinks I'm doing. But like it's a recurring dream. Like every night I will have this dream that I'm flying with my head. I mean, really, it's probably gonna be one of those things where my family think i'm psychic and it just ends up being autism again please let me mount let's ride <laughs> i forgot we called the, the horse horsey and i was like oh look at the sims Street being cute <laughs> okay i think i'm just gonna mount and um, instead of tr like going in straight away to training i think we should just go for a ride and hopefully that gets our skill off yeah now we have one skill we've grasped the basics of riding also you were hungry how do i feed you did you just piss yourself that is embarrassing like i can be responsible for you all the time eugene you've got to take a fucking some responsibility for yourself i love this in stream right i'm gonna make my mac and cheese and then to oh my god saddle saw that looks like a giant toot which is probably what you've done because you just have to take a shower all right go to bed, go to sleep and cure it and you are also going to sleep i will meet you in the morning where we are going to be training again and then we're going to join the equipment in korea my dudes it's the equestrian korea my dudes okay he's not actually awake yet but my horse is he is a little bit bored so there is pet stuff on the outside what is this oh incinerating fire pit all right we have a salt lick a water trowel trough i swear there's more though like where have they got all this from let's just get everything for a horse we have this big bastard an advanced water obstacle Ooh. I'm going to delete this one and put the advanced water obstacle in. I don't know what this hitching post is. And a happy horse ball. We'll put a couple of happy horse balls in because I want a really happy horse. Now I think we're ready to go. Let's have a quick meal. Waffles. Eat the waffles. Don't play with the fucking ball because of your abysmal performance yesterday. I'm going to make sure you do go to the toilet. Right. Mount. Mount. Jump. Oh, we are now at level three. I think the horse is a bit too scared though. We could try this one, the mini one. I love that it puts a thingy on the horses. Okay, we've done that. G fucking G. I think we can try the big one yet. No. What about if we remove rails? Hey, we did it. I want to see if he'll do this one. Probably not, but I'll give it a go. No. Well, that's all right. I'm going to what? I'm going to go to the equestrian center. What's this neighborhood pet adoption? I can't get distracted by that because I will. Sh oh, the show's actually on. Okay. You know what? I've never bred a mare. I'm going to attend the riding class. This is the equestrian center in The Sims 3. I think The Sims 4 is just going to be the exact same thing. If I'm going to be honest, like I don't think we'll be able to go in it. Tomorrow at 5 p.m. is the next equestrian center. Right. Everybody go home. I don't know why you've literally chosen to take a car when the horse was there. I mean, the horse did run off. So you know what? I will, I will say that. I'm going to send him to bed. No, don't relax. Relax. The leap. And you, I'm going to make you work all night, actually. I want to win. And I'm just going to cheat the needs <laughs> in the morning. Bless me. Testing cheats enabled. True. Okay, I'll meet you in the morning. What the fuck is this noise? What is this noise? Ah! Clement, what happened to you, darling? We can. Oh no, I wanted to. I mean, a ghost can drive. <laughs> I wanted to beg him for a carrot. Wait, Clement, where are you going? Let wait. I need to find him because I need to follow where he's going. Come on, Clement, take me on an adventure. <laughs> Watch him end up at the graveyard or something. I mean, he's really. What is this place, Clement? Where are you leading us? Uh, where is it? It's a fishing spot. Interesting. We'll never know. I forgot that we were doing this. I mean, we're level four racing now. Like, we might actually be quite good at it. And level four jumping. I'm going to wake... Well, I mean, he's already awake, so I don't, I don't make everybody happy. I mean, just look at the lighting in this pack, though. It's so autumnal. And being you know, autumn is my favorite season ever. Like, there's just no comparing to autumn for me. Oh, a rootin' rootin' cowboy. But yeah, there's just no... There's no comparison. And this world is like, it, it, it's my autumnal dream. Honestly, it's it's absolutely beautiful. This also, like where I live is right next to the countryside too. Middlesbrough is really industrialized. But then also on the other side of it, it's also literally the countryside. So this looks like my town almost, which is cute. Then it also doesn't. Like imagine eco lifestyle, that town on its like smoggiest day. That's what you see one way. But then you turn around and you just see this which honestly is a good mix for me it's my favorite mix right you are doing too much please i want to ride you <gasps> oh our best friend is a horse and he's our only friend so he's our best friend and our worst friend at the same time because we've only got the one 5 p.m i need to remember 5 p.m wild horse can i can i let you sniff my hand please fuck this competition i need to adopt another horse guys i need to adopt another horse this is my life's mission oh babe literally feed treat 
All right. Okay. What if I just watched you? No, he's ran. He's ran. It's all right. Where's our horse? Feeling a little bit neglected, I assume, because we just tried to make it. Uh, you know, we, we did abandon our horse for another horse as soon as I made best friends with him. I don't care who was ringing me. No. Can we do this now? I just really want to try this. Oh, we did it. Do it again. Oh, well, that is performance anxiety if I ever seen it. But literally, honestly, don't worry about us all watching. Oh my God, he fucking did it again when I sped it up. Right. Sorry, horse. You're going to have to do this again and again. Oh, it's 5 p.m. So I think we're going to mount and then I'm going to make sure we're all in the best mood before the competition. I don't know if that makes a difference. So I'll be honest. But you know what? I'm going to, I'm going to try it. Attend riding class. Let's ride. God, I just love to feel that feeling. I mean, his legs have seen better days, I'm not gonna lie. Uh, oh. Okay, we are actually in a riding class now, which is great. Love that for us. I'm gonna have to come out of the riding class, actually, because the competition is at 5 p.m. I'm getting a bit stressed about it. <laughs> Attend equestrian competition. $200 uh, simoleons per sim. Who the fuck's DNT? Come on, let's go. No! Attend equestrian competition with horse. No! Attend equestrian competition with the fucking horse. We're gonna miss it. We're literally gonna miss it. We didn't miss it. Okay, go in. No, no. Attend this fucking equestrian competition with the horse. You were also supposed to go in. I swear to God. I swear to God. I'm gonna fucking clap the sim right across the fucking face. Attend with the horse. All oh, right, I've got it. I've got it. We had to be on the horse. Sorry, that's me. All right, we're going to try again tomorrow. I'm going to remain so cool, calm, and collected. I'll meet you again tomorrow and try and get us into the fucking show. All right, it's 4.25. We are going to prepare. Mount the horse. We have three minutes. Okay, go. Enter a question competition. Racing competition. Beginner. Go. Just be so seamless, guys. Oh, that was so seamless. Okay, we are currently 12... We're first. We're first. G fucking G. G fucking G. We didn't even need to change your pace. Lovely. Wow, we actually got a decent bit of money from that as well. We won a beginner racing competition. We already did that. Enter a beginning race cross country competition. Do we have time for another one? Because that was kind of slay. Enter a question competition, racing competition, or maybe show jumping competition. Beginner. Go. Go, go. Go. Go, go. Okay, we're 10th, 9th, 6th, 5th. Come on. 3rd. Second. Come on, first, 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 first. Yes! Fuck you, Fortune. Right, let's go home. I'm going to speed forward until the next day because I'm having so much fun winning competitions. Actually, guys, I want to win every type of competition. I'll see you again 5 p.m. Also, we got level six riding skill. We can now enter cross-country competitions. Right, it's nearing... Oh, my God, I haven't even put my fucking camera on. It's nearing 5 a.m. 5 p.m. Mount the horse. Right. I'm going to enter equestrian competition. No, oh, enter equestrian competition. Cross-country competition. We're going to try just beginner at first and see how that goes. Although we are like level seven, so we are really good. But watch us not even get first. Come on. Yes. Very good. Although that was a bit of a struggle. Like we didn't get that as fast as I thought we would. Right. Now we're going to try racing. Let's go international. I just want to see. Right. Okay, we're ninth. I kind of want to go for broke. I just want to see how that goes. Come on. Come on, Eugene. Come on. Level seven. I mean, we're position seven in the Pleasant View Derby. I'm literally so offended. We are so much higher than level seven. I wish it was on all the time. I hate having to wait at 5 p.m. How far are we in our lifetime aspiration? We've only got 1,600. It's going to be a it's gonna be a long slog this life for me. Yeah. I'm at the Equestrian Train Center. It's the next day. We trained all throughout the night. We are level nine racing and you are level eight riding. I'm going to try for an international one again. I need to get you off him, though, because he... Horsey needs to rest before a big tear. And Horsey also wants to win an international racing competition, so I need to be prepared for that. Right, it's 4.27. On. Mount. It's 5 p.m. Enter equestrian. Is that the right one? Yeah. Enter equestrian. Racing. International. Go. You can do it. Oh. Oh. Sixth. Fifth. Take risks. Fuck it. Take risks. Take risks. Fourth isn't bad. I'm going to try again. Enter a question competition, racing, international. Go. And I'm not going to take risks this time. I'm just going to see how we do without taking risks. Just to keep in a steady pace. Fifth. Fourth. Okay, so we're consistently fourth. So almost over. Right. I think that tonight we can 100% master this entire thing. So we'll try again tomorrow. Okay, the horse is level 10. The rider is level 9. I think we have a decent chance at it. Where are you? Okay, right. Mount the horse. Enter a question competition. Racing international. Go. Okay, seven, six, fifth, fourth. Come on, higher than third. Second, potentially? Second? You know what? 
Go for broke. Maybe don't go for broke. Take risks. Second. <gasps> Second is good. Second is the first to lose. Enter. Racing. International. Go. I'm going to get steady until we get to like fourth or third. And now I'm going to take risks. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. You can do first. Come on, please. Oh. Well, second is a lot better. Do you know what I mean? Come on. Take risks. Take risks. Take risks. Please first. Fuck Uma. Guys, I literally don't know literally how we can get first. And we could only enter one because I missed the times for it. Tomorrow at five. Okay. I need to get a level number one until we can get there. I mean, we've made 8,800 so far out of 40. Suddenly, I've made my horses try for a fall. I may have just fucked that up for me. Oh my god, I literally can't even mount the horse because she's pregnant. Okay, let me see if I can saddle you. No! Okay, well, do you know what? I brought the second horse again, so you know what? Maybe we just mount you and then we will enter a racing advanced. Let's just try that. Let's see how that goes. Oh, see, Hensley just found out she's having a baby. Okay, third isn't bad for advanced. Right, let's enter racing beginning. Dinner. Let's just try that. I would just like to get first. Do you know what I mean? We haven't had a first in a long time. Easy. How long until you give birth? Five days. Oh, wait, no. Never mind. Three days. Okay, we could do three days. I'm literally not even entertaining that music anymore because the last time I was on a wild goose chase to a fucking fish. Oh, wait, is that either or? Because it says that we've completed a lifetime wish, but we haven't completed the full one. I never knew that was either or. I really did not. What is that? Oh, I thought it was a baby norm. It's a communist fall. Okay, I'm going to check back in when she's had the baby. Marcy just gave birth to a fall. What do you want to call it? Baharmy. Nah. Glooch. Oh. Baharmi. I'll just call you Baharmi. Baharmi Naglujnar. Oh, that's so cute. And Gigi on the baby and everything. I'm just really excited to be able to take you into a competition because we will be winning today. We really will. Maybe. Is it because we're not winning 100% because we need to do more jumping? Take risks. Take risks. Fucking third. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. But we are literally level 10. Like, that's absolutely... That is incorrect. Uh, okay, let's just do it national and we don't take risks or anything. Go for broke. Okay. I didn't fucking do anything. I'm just going to practice jumping one more time. Literally, if we don't win the next competition, it is rigged. And that is all I have to say. Second, come on. Come on. Honestly, it's fucking, it's just fucking rigged, isn't it? Like, that's the thing at the end of the day. It's fucking rigged. There's no, but I mean, obviously, like, it's just fucking rigged. It does not want me. International. Maybe cross country would be an idea as well. There's no way we're doing even worse at show jumping. A second. I'll take a second, you know. Right, and let me just try. Oh, are you fucking joking? I want to try cross country. Well, do you know what? I fucking had enough because it's fucking rigged, isn't it? Like, I'm not being funny. But I've sat here every single day with cheats, right? Max everybody's needs to the top. Max everybody's skills to the top. Spend every fucking day with this horse. It's rigged. But anyway, I had a great time today. I'm excited for horse running stuff. I really hope that they make it excellent in Sims 4. He's hoping. He's hoping. I'm also excited for the sheep. Anyway, that's everything I have for you today. I love you all so, so much. Let me know if you've ever won one because I haven't to this day. I've still never won one because it's fucking rigged. Love you all so, so much. I'll see you in the next one. Bye, bitch.